Something about Jenny Farley and Zach Clayton Carpinello seemed written in the stars. After going public in April 2019, their relationship sadly hit a wall after one dramatic episode of Jersey Shore Family Vacation. This is the real reason Jay Wow split from her latest boyfriend. Ah, young love, Jenny Farley was undoubtedly enamored with her younger beau at the start, but there's a chance their romance simply wasn't sustainable. When things start out with a bang, they're typically prone to fizzling a little faster. I am flooded with emotions because I actually never thought I was going to be madly in love with somebody ever again, but I'm praying it's going to be good. But emotions weren't the only things flowing. In an episode of Jersey Shore Family Vacation, the reality star admitted that things were getting a little too hot and heavy with Zach, and all that intense physical activity was starting to take a toll on her body. In a fit of TMI, JWoww revealed that she was having, quote, lots and lots and lots of bedroom romps with the wrestler, then joked that she might need an ice pack to help recover from all the lovin'. It's no secret that Jay Wow doesn't always get along with Jersey Shore co-star Angelina Pavarnik. The reality TV star's ongoing feud is one of the MTV series' major plot points, but season three of Family Vacation might have actually burned that bridge forever. According to People, Farley was blindsided after watching an October 2019 episode that took place during a trip to Las Vegas. Carpinello, who accompanied Farley and her castmates, appeared to get a little hands-on with Angelina. Farley was all but passed out at the time and only found out what happened once the scene aired, months later. She wrote in part on Instagram, After seeing tonight's episode, I'm pretty hurt. I feel disrespected by someone I called a friend and by someone who stated they loved me. For five months, I was naive, probably laughed at and made into a storyline that will forever haunt me. According to Us Weekly, Farley ended her relationship with Carpinello shortly after watching this episode. Things between Zack and Angelina were apparently sketchy from the beginning. Even before the Vegas incident, Carpinello had previously pressed Pivarnik for details about her love life with fiancé Chris. Needless to say, the conversation made Angelina feel more than a little uncomfortable. This kid is 24 years old. He knows nothing about relationships, okay? He's probably been a nun in his entire life. And another thing, too, he doesn't know me. Farley later slammed Pivarnik on Twitter and argued that she willingly divulged the details. Even if Pavarnik isn't the most reliable narrator, both Dina and Vinny voiced that they didn't think Carpinella was acting appropriately either. And best friends generally know best. What the f is he doing? He's such a weirdo. It's never advisable to flirt with your girlfriend's roommates, but it's even less advisable to do so in front of cameras that are only going to blast out your behavior for millions of viewers to watch. Most viewers don't blame Farley for kicking Carpinello to the curb, but that doesn't mean he didn't try to apologize and it just doesn't seem like JWoww was willing to accept it. <laughs> the day after that already infamous episode of Jersey Shore Family Vacation aired, Carpinello took to Instagram to apologize to the reality TV mom. He wrote, I made mistakes that I cannot take back, which I take full responsibility for. Jenny does not deserve any damage from anybody else. This is on me. I sincerely apologize to Jenny. I apologize to Angelina as well. I love Jenny with everything I have. I make this known to her every day." According to Entertainment Tonight, neither Farley or Pivarnik have publicly responded to Carpinello's apology. Jenny already had some reservations about bringing Zack around her castmates. Though the obviously smitten mother of two wanted to introduce her new beau to her Jersey Shore family, she wasn't really sure he could handle that sort of environment. We'll see what happens, because once you start bringing somebody into our world that's not used to it, that's when all the fun starts. In a season three episode of Family Vacation, Farley admitted she was, quote, excited but low-key about to throw up over Carpinello finally meeting her Seaside Heights crew. She added, I'm a little anxious having 24 in this environment. You never know what's going to come out of my roommate's mouths, and that's the concerning part. Turned out her fears weren't unfounded. Farley's roommates immediately started talking about Carpinello's love life the minute he walked in the door, and he found himself struggling to keep up. The others definitely noticed. 24 isn't rolling with the punches. It was just what we do, you know? We break each other's balls. Like, come on. Of course, Jenny's ex-husband, Roger Matthews, had to weigh in on her headline making split from Zach. In a surprising turn of events, Matthews actually offered some insight about life as a reality TV boyfriend. In short, it ain't easy. Not easy being a princess. No, it ain't easy at all. You wouldn't know. This could be part of the reason Carpinello and Farley didn't last. Matthews told Us Weekly, 
The very premise and settings for the show make it incredibly hard on relationships, both while filming and at home. I would never blame the show. It's a personal choice to be part of it, but I've always thought Sammy choosing her personal sanity and privacy by not participating in the new season spoke volumes about her character. Sammy's sweetheart Giancola was the sole member of the original Jersey Shore cast who didn't return for the series reboot. In an Instagram post, she admitted she was focusing on business and her relationship and trying to avoid what she called toxic situations. You can't help but wonder if Farley's latest romance would have turned out differently if the cameras weren't rolling. End of the day, you have not experienced what we all have experienced together. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite stars are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.